All right, thank you, Cam. Well, the heavy rain tonight put a damper on some of the Juneteenth celebrations in the area. Yeah, the event in Sun Prairie took a big hit because of the weather. Jarrell Ballard was there just before it got canceled. He has you covered on how their community plans to reschedule. Weather is one of the unpredictable things that you hope for, for good weather, but if you get bad weather, you just have to roll with it. Heavy rain passing through Sun Prairie on Wednesday caused the city to cancel their annual Juneteenth celebration. When we first came, it was not looking like it was going to rain. It was a little bit cloudy, but we thought it was going to pass since it was only a 20%. When the rain first started, it was like, oh, you're just going to last about five, ten minutes. And it kept going. Like, you know what, do we leave or do we like stay in? figure out you know what's next so we, we decided to stay and the rain here at Wetmore Park has been coming down throughout the evening you can see the group of vendors behind me who have started to take down their booth but as you look around there's a large group of community members who were eager to celebrate the Juneteenth holiday even though it's raining it's still Juneteenth and Juneteenth is a very special day and that's why I stuck around Dozens of people took shelter nearby while students from Northside Elementary School presented a Juneteenth poem. So even though we got rained out out here, we still came out, hung out, had a good time, talked with some people. It, it's kind of the spirit of the, the event. Everyone still stuck around. Ultimately, the organizers deciding to cancel the event when it started to thunder. We're going to continue feeding people um, and then we're going to work on rescheduling it on a better day so the community can come back out. Reporting in Sun Prairie, Jarrell Ballard, 27 News.